Hey, this is Cassandra Shaw reporting for Kids Pick Flicks, and guess what? We're here at the press conference of Divergent. The only way our society can survive is for each of you to claim your rightful place. Today, you will take a test that will help you discover who you truly are. The movie, The Dystopian Society, forces characters into different factions and characters are forced to come form. So I was wondering, in your life, in this industry or in real life in general, how do people perceive you in a way that isn't true to who you really are? Yeah, I mean, for me, I right away I'm trying not to only play like a leading man kind of character. That's why like Caleb is awesome for me to play. Uh, he's not the leading man. Because, you know, you can easily be pigeonholed in this industry. But it also in life, you know, I I think that is actually one nice thing about being an actor, though, is that ideally you're able to play a lot of different characters and be different people all the time. And uh, as human beings, we I think we all strive to sort of be divergents. Welcome to Villainous. The two stages of training. The first is physical. Push your bodies to the breaking point. You're never gonna win. I like that. It's good to know. Keep tension here, okay? The second is mental. Face your worst fears and conquer them. Hi, I'm Cassandra. Uh, I was wondering, in the movie, Triss is perceived differently after she joins Dauntless. So how have people perceived you differently before and after you accepted this role? Good question. <laughs> well, it all begins with uh, the morning in uh, 2009. Uh, uh, how have they perceived it differently? Well. Um, maybe there is more awareness of me before. Uh, I think, you know, before I did this, people were like, you know, they thought I was, you know, cleaning the toilet or something, and it happened to, happened to be there for the audition, but no. In, in seriousness, <laughs> I, uh, I don't think I've experienced it too much, to be honest, at the moment. The, the press kind of tour we just did, it was, it, you know, it was interesting, because suddenly we saw some of the fandom, but I don't think perceptions of me have changed massively. Um, you know, I think it will be important for me as I go on because there potentially are three films um, to make choices that are, as much as I love the character before, but to make smart choices that are very different from him and the world that he and everyone else in the film inhabits. In the beginning of the movie, not everyone knows or can see that Triss is divergent. So I was wondering, for you personally, what is something that people don't see or know about you? I feel like we should ask those four people back there who know me really well. What is that? <laughs> um, oh man. Uh, I feel like I'm pretty. I'm kind of. I'm. I'm kind of an obvious person. I'm, I don't really have. I like to keep you know some some things in my life sacred, like keep the sacred sacred. But apart from that part of my life, I'm a very open person. So I feel like what you sort of see right now is kind of who I am always. Maybe I guess that's different. <laughs> if you want to survive, follow me. Divergents threaten the system. It won't be safe until they're removed. We have to fight back. Ready. 